Hello. Um, okay, so today I am working with a couple puppies that are here for board and train. Um, Bella and Cash, they are two six month old brother and sister German Shepherd puppies. Um, and one of their mom's major complaints is that they always attack the broom. So um, we've already been working on their no reward marker a lot. We've been working on their leave it a lot. Um, so now, since they already have both of those skills, I'm gonna apply those to teaching them to stop attacking the broom. Um, you'll probably notice as I do this that I'm gonna intermittently use like leave it um, and uh -uh, really whatever comes to my mind at this point. Um, generally, if it's like a, uh, like a really quick thing, I'm always gonna go with the no reward marker because it just means stop what you're doing and try something else. Um, they respond pretty well to the leave it as well, so I'll use that too, um, but pretty much as long as they're backing off and leaving the broom alone, I'm gonna go ahead and reward them for it. So um, I'm gonna back up so that you can see, um, and I'm gonna show you what it looks like. Uh -uh. Good girl, thank you. Good girl. No, good girl. Leave it. Good girl. Good girl. Leave it. Uh -uh. Good girl. So what I'm doing right now is I'm giving her the leave it cue as like a prep thing so she knows that something's coming. And then I'm using my no reward marker to correct her if she still tries to go for it anyways. Yes, good girl. Good girl. Leave it. Leave it. Good girl. Thank you. Good girl. Leave it. Good girl. Uh -uh. Good girl. Thank you. Leave it. Good girl. Good girl, Bella. Leave it. Good girl. Thank you. That was a hard one, huh? Bella, can you sit? Good. Leave it. Yes! Oh, we got some good puppies. Very good. Leave it. Bella, leave it. Yes, that's a good Bella. Yes, it is. That's a good Bella. Leave it. Oh, good girl. Uh, good girl. I really need a treat. Let's go get you a treat. Come on, let's go. Okay, so that's how we would go about that. Um, as you can see, that was very, very difficult for her. Um, she would do really good one second and then she'd want to go after it the next. So um, I'm going to keep working this over the next couple of days. I'll keep you updated on how it goes. And what we're trying to get to the point is where like she doesn't really feel the need to attack it at all. But at the very least right now, we have a way to get her to disengage and drop it right away. Okay.